Emma Willard had a unique idea, a bold idea to give excellent education to women at a time when that wasn't even thought about. We're going into our third century and we have 200 years behind us of perfecting the craft of educating girls. Leading with purpose, our strategic plan is intentional. The process had to be open. It involved the board, the voices of the faculty, the staff, alumni, parents, students. The plan allows us to put a reality to hopes and dreams. This plan comes at a time when Emma is feeling bold and courageous and humble and hopeful all at once. When we started this process, we recognized that students are different from the students we even had 10 years ago. So we're introducing new pedagogy into our classroom and we're changing our curriculum. The plan is responding to what does the world need from us? What do the students need from us? And how can we contribute and continue to be a vital force in the life of the school? Intellectually, emotionally, socially, people here are so dedicated to the success of our students. The thrill about this profession is that it's ever evolving, ever changing, and ever responding to the world around us. This is the place where we experiment together, try new things, and where we are really committed to growth and development as faculty. In order to have a strong academic program here, and to really claim it and own it, you have to be able to implement diversity, equity, and inclusion, and a sense of belonging as well. Independent schools have the gift of being able to intentionally craft communities of learning. There is as diverse a community as possible because there is a richness of perspectives that enriches all of us. Not only do we have the community who are here every day, but we have 8,000 alumni all over the world. And so what we mean by connection is to create a sense of belonging, of I'm not alone, of I have somebody else who has walked in these shoes before, and I can take this path a little further because of it. There is history and magic that happens in our buildings every day, and it takes maintaining them, nurturing them, repurposing them to make sure that the program of today can be delivered effectively in these buildings. Our endowment makes it possible to have excellent education, teachers, facilities, programs, and to not depend so enormously on tuition. So we want to build our resources so that any student worthy of an Emma Willard education can come to this school, even if they don't have the means to do it. What it means to me as an alumna is making it purposeful to today because today's world is not like the world that I experienced when I was at Emma Willard. I almost feel like we've been built for this moment when the world needs leaders of purpose, of conviction, of truth. I think it's what Emma Willard herself was about all along. There's an electricity on campus and among our alumni because there's an urgency today to impact this broad, complex world. It's the exact opposite of passivity. It's this need to engage. It's a galvanizing force that brings us all together around the initiatives we're most excited about. We are seeking to keep Emma Willard's vision alive. I think she said, you've identified the needs of our current moment in history, and you're trying to meet the demands of that moment in the same way that I did. I think we have a great strategic plan here, but are we ready to act? And I think Emma Willard is. It means adapting what we've always done well and making it relevant. Everyone owns this plan and is excited about it because it will be up to all of us to execute it with success.